All right, guys, KB32 here. Check it out. We're sitting in the Freedom Studio, and today I'm going through some dry fire practice. Uh, what does that entail? Well, one is let's get the rig on. We're shooting the USPSA Nationals PCC2 gun down in the Talladega. I think that's how it's pronounced with my good friend Pops Quest. So I'm not like one of those guys that sits there diligently every single day like the humble marksman or some other folks and, and I try to practice and practice and practice. I'm kind of like one of those guys that, uh, well, I think I could build that muscle memory up in about a month, which is what exactly I have. So what are we doing? I've got the rig on that I'll be using down there. It consists of uh, a Safari Land belt. Uh, I've got some Ghost Tactical. I think these are the mag pouches here. I've got some extended mags. I can't even remember who does the extensions on those. Uh, and I've got a, a Red Hill Tactical uh, holster with the uh, Stoger uh, Boss Hanger. But I haven't put them on yet. I haven't even practiced with it. I haven't even tried it out. I haven't seen how it was work or will work. So what do I do? I put it on and then I just kind of go through the process of practicing, extending out, and pulling a trigger. So what makes it more interesting is a couple of things. One is put a timer on. Uh, when you shoot competition, there's nothing more fun than to hear the sound of this. Yeah, the beep. Every second counts. Everything is on the clock at that point in time. So one of the hardest things to do, especially when you're starting off with pistol, is to draw stroke that thing up, bring it out, press, and get on target and hit accurately in an A zone. So here's what I have done in order to practice for that. Just on the pistol part of it, we'll talk about the rifle here in a minute. I am using uh, the Legion X5 with the Delta Point Pro dot on it because we're shooting open. Now, a couple things that I have learned is I'm covering the front of this dot with some tape. And what that does is it makes me target focused versus dot focused. A good thing that I learned from a good friend, Pops. He told him, try it, see how you like it. And it's actually quite natural to me because I go to the target and I'm also, I'm shooting with both eyes open. I've always done that except back on the day when you were doing this right here. So anyway, what's another part that helps with this whole situation, just bear with me, we're gonna to get to the point of it, is uh, this little thing, this laser deal from uh, this company called Hits Arms. Now there's a couple of people that are familiar with these things, some people aren't. Now what is it? Well, let me show you. Go ahead and eject this thing. Well, unfortunately, <laughs> well, fortunately, um, I have it situated where there, uh, the rim on the back of the casing is uh, cut out so that you can cock it, and I'll demonstrate that here in a few seconds. All right, let's talk about this. You have a little booger like this. It has a little laser in it. it. has a little rubber pad on the back of it, and every time your striker pin or firing pin hits it, it emits a laser. Why do I want that? Well, there's a couple of reasons. When you get up to the line, and you're getting ready to shoot. When you draw and you hit that first round, a lot of times that thing, you might be aiming there, but it'll hit over there. This is allowing me to see where I'm actually aiming the pistol. So a lot of times when I sit here and post smoke up everybody's ass and talk about how I am being target focused versus being dot focused, the tell tall secret is this little laser showing you where it's hitting. Um, so anyway, the cool part about it is it does have the cutout right there so you can continuously uh, cock and the striker without pulling the casing out of it. You just got to position it in the pistol so that it will work. So there. Well, I didn't have it positioned right. So we got to do that again. We'll go to a cut until I actually get it right. See how that works? So what I can do, all I gotta do is barely push it out, and I'm showing this, rifle. <laughs> this thing's empty. It emits a laser that stays on for about uh, two tenths of a second, I would say. Uh, so what that does is I'm able to set targets up in, in, say, one here, one over there, one over there. Go ahead and hit the clock. And the idea is to get that draw stroke and that pull on the trigger, bam! as you're rolling out like that. A lot of fun. Uh, let's talk about this thing here real quickly. These guys are made in America. So anyway, a lot of instructions on the back of this thing. It retails for $69. There is a discount code KB32 also that you can use, but this is a really cool deal. A lot, I mean, I've actually had people ask me, why would you want this? Well, not necessarily for training, but just anything else. Boom. 
Boom. Let's see if I can get it to go in there. Do that one more time. All right. So the cool thing is I want to mate up because I can actually see the dot in the red dot and I can see the dot on the target. As long as those are matching, then I know that I'm draw stroking out and it's proper. I will tell you this, man, I've been in many a competition where I'm sitting there and when you have a dot on the pistol, that thing is just all over the place, especially if you've had to run. I'm not the greatest shape of person in the world, but this thing is perfect for training. Like that. Uh, another thing I want to show you just before we end, this is the PCC Elite. This is the firearm that we'll be using down there. You can use it in this guy as well. All right, uh, guys, I hope that works. I'm going to put the website down below. Hit arms. If you're wanting to train, go ahead and take a look at this thing. But uh, it is one of those things that I actually uh, dig. And it is usable. It's boom. It's even better if you don't have a dot. Hit's arm. It's a little deal right here. Y'all let me know what your thoughts are down below if you've used one of these things. I know I've heard a couple guys say they actually have used them. Uh, but in any case, we always hit them like this. Sport red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless us men, women in uniform, 24-7 for our freedom. This freedom is not free. Cool little deal. They come out of Miami. Go to Boy32. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe and have already done so. I am out of here. Y'all be good. Boom.